Hi guys, good morning. Um, so I'm just doing another vlog from Sri Lanka. I came to Sri Lanka on the 19th of February. I've been facing lots of challenges. Usually I'm in, uh, in Australia, either in Tasmania, Queensland or somewhere else, living in nature, living under trees and enjoying a very simple uh, lifestyle in nature. But since I came to Colombo, uh, I've been surrounded by this concrete jungle. So what I thought was I've never done a, a proper fast, like a 48 hour fast at least, because I'm not in a very good headspace at the moment. And also my physical health is not 100%. I thought it's a good, good time to reset my biological clock and, and my mental space. So I thought doing a 48 hour fast would, would be a really good option. So I ate last night and uh, at the moment I'm just having some turmeric tea because I'm fasting at the moment. Uh, without any honey or sugar or anything, it's just herbal tea. And uh, I will drink some herbal tea from time to time during the fast. I've been inspired by others to, to try some fasting. Now this is nothing to do with my spiritual life. This fast is purely a physical thing. So, I'm thinking of uh, fasting for 48 hours and since last night, it will be not tonight but tomorrow night is when I will start eating again. I'll start with something like, like vegetable broth uh, because when you're coming out of a fast, you should have a light meal and then the next day morning I'll, I'll eat. So throughout this fast, I'll update you and also talk a few medical things that happens when you're fasting. Just a disclaimer, so if you're, if you have any chronic illnesses or if you're not very fit, please consult your healthcare professional before you do a fast. If you have certain illnesses that might harm you, they can take a decision based on that. So I'll take you along on my journey and update you as I go along. or 17 hours into the fast now. I meditated this morning, about 12 hours into the fast at about 9 o'clock, 10 o'clock, and I was feeling really hungry. Uh, the hunger was there and then it gradually disappeared. But I've been doing my, my normal day, daily things. I, I went for a walk, went and bought my mother some books. And uh, I'm just going down to the pool now to have a swim. This is all in my, my parents' apartment complex. It's a beautiful place in the heart of Colombo, a place called Crescat, Crescat Residency. So. Just going to use the fire exit. It's amazing. I don't feel tired or I don't feel lack of energy. I don't feel hungry at all going for a swim now and then I'll keep updating you. Nothing like swimming in wild nature. But have to make do with what we what I have.
uh, so I am now about 24 hours into my fasting. I really feel good. I mean, I don't, I still have a lot of energy. I'm a little bit hungry, but uh, it comes and goes. I also had a pot of Earl Grey tea. I made a light Earl Grey tea because Earl Grey contains something called bergamot oil. And bergamot oil uh, is supposed to stimulate something called autophagy. Now, autophagy is a natural process of the body where the cells get rid of uh, cell particles that it doesn't need or, or the cell particles that are no longer functional uh, or that are old. By fasting, uh, this natural process of autophagy happens because you're starving the body from nutrients and this cleansing, natural cleansing process takes place. So when you're fasting and when you take Earl Grey tea, I think uh, it further stimulates the process of autophagy. I'm just experimenting with my own body at the moment by, uh, by fasting and doing various things. And uh, I like to find out for myself the things that I can do. But I mean, yeah, so I'm just giving you some information of research that I've done plus my own experience of experience of fasting Good morning my dear friends I'm just uh, I've been lying down and uh, just observing my sensations of meditating I'm now 33 hours into the fast and uh, last night I sat in bed and meditated a little bit it felt so strong my mind has so much of clarity at the moment I, I don't feel hungry I have this sensation in my body or this feeling that uh, feeling of a little bit of weakness because I haven't given any food in uh, something like 33 hours but at the same time I don't feel weak I have a feeling of weakness but I don't feel weak it's it's weird but I have so much of mental clarity as if there is no sluggishness there is no mistiness or haziness it's very very clear but it's hard to explain I feel really good I'm now 33 hours into fasting I feel really good hey guys just updating you so I'm just going for another swim early morning thinking that I don't have that much energy to, to do active exercise but it just feels like a normal day even though I'm on the fast actually it even felt like I had more energy than a normal day
just about to break my fast now and it's almost 48 hours I did a few mistakes when my friend friend came today I met him actually in a in a small cafe and he went to have lunch uh, but I just wanted to to talk to him because I haven't seen him in a long while so I had some soda uh, which I shouldn't have taken it was just I just wanted some sparkling water but they didn't have it so they only had soda but I shouldn't have had that so I had about 300 mils of soda and apart from that I've been having green tea herbal tea and some Earl Grey tea uh, which I think next time when I do a fast I'll do a water only fast and I'm aiming at 72 hours in my next fast so I I cook some real good uh, vegetable soup and I'm going to have some soup now no bread just the soup uh, and tomorrow I'll go back to having a light breakfast have some fruit and just have a normal breakfast thank you so I'm going to enjoy my meal thank you for joining me in this journey I might have spoken too much I have, might have spoken too less I might have not spoken about the things that you want to hear I might have spoken too much of things that you already know and maybe irrelevant things uh, next time I'll try to be more mindful just please give me your comments leave a comment and in my next 72 hour fast that I will do maybe in two weeks time or in one month's time I don't know maybe even sooner I'll be more diligent thank you bye for now